Waterfall braids with knots, step by step. Today, I'm going to show you two similar braids which I think you're going to love. For the first option, you want to grab a section of hair, bring it to the back, and now you hold that section, take another one, and you want to make a simple knot, just crossing both sections over each other. Now you want to hold it like that and take a bobby pin to secure that in place. Take the section at the top and now you want to take another section of hair and repeat the same step. You want to make a single knot just like that crossing one section over the other. Now you want to take a bobby pin and secure that section in place. And that's pretty much all you need to do over and over again. So you take your top section, take a section right next to it, cross them over each other, making a simple knot. Then you have to hold onto that knot, take a bobby pin and secure it in place, making sure it's hidden under the knot. As for the last crossing, I just like to grab a section from the front, cross them over each other, stick a bobby pin just like we did before and now with the top section we're just going to lay it flat like that and stick a bobby pin so that it will stay in place and that's it you're done You can totally leave it like this, which looks more put together, or you can remove all the bobby pins and pinch your knots a little to give your hair more volume and to end up with bigger, fluffier knots. This is the final result. For this option, you want to take a section of hair, bring it to the back, wrap it around your fingers. Now give it a little twist and holding that little section, take a bobby pin and secure it in place as you can see this knot looks like a p shape put your fingers through the loop take a section right next to it and try to pull it only halfway through you don't want to pull it all the way just halfway through now take another section create another loop and put your fingers through that loop again take another section pass it halfway through and you keep on doing that. It looks like a chain. You just need to be very careful to pull your section just halfway through. And by creating those little loops, you just connect one section with the other. Keep on doing the same thing until you reach the opposite side of your head. At this point, you want to twist your little loop, pin it in place with some bobby pins, and that's it. This is the final result. Which of the two braids did you like the best? I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave your comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check me on Facebook, Twitter, and on my website www.patrickjordan.com. Share the love with your friends and see you soon.